up wedding nerdigans this is the one and only packer girl 89 and today's manga nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for kingdom chapter 496 and before i get on with the um live reaction there's one thing i'm going to mention as um i mentioned in the previous video i am still doing i started doing the weekly manga nerdigan podcast um and i did it this past saturday and it was fun and um, I'm going to do one again this upcoming Saturday at 11:30 uh, p.m. Eastern Standard Time, 8:30 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Hopefully, you guys come and we could chat in the Google Hangout and have some fun and talk about Kingdom and all the other manga that I've been covering. And this week, we're also going to be covering Akame ga Kiru because the chapter came out this week or it came out today, which is Sunday. And oh my freaking god, it was good. Anyway. Let's get to the live reaction. So, last week for Kingdom was interesting. So, we found out that Say is going to go with a more unorthodox strategy. And I still think that Conky is going to just fucking be in the mountains, just trolling everybody. And I hope, Roboku, your your motherfucking ass better be in the mountains because we need a Conky versus Roboku. Because Roboku is going to fight Shin at some point, but it's not going to be for a while. It won't be. Because Roboku is going to be distracted by Conky. That's what I think is going to happen. But anyway. Um, uh, and I love Rishi. I love what happened with Rishi. That shit was so funny. Like, he's just like, I don't give a fuck if you forgive me. I wouldn't blame you. I was just like, damn, I love the brutal honesty. Anyway, now let's get with the this next chapter and see what happens with Kingdom. So, 10th... 10th year of reign. Having emerged triumphant in the Battle of Kokuyu, the state of Kin turned its attention in, inwards towards domestic affairs. Some say that this was the year that Kin would take its first st uh, step forward following the shocking events of um, Ru Rui's Ru ah, Ru eyes, there we go, rebellion. With Rio Fui's involvement in the Ru eyes uh, rebellion exposed, he was stripped of his rank. While the uh, queen mother, who had been confined to the city of, of Yu, returned it to um, Kanyo's Kansen Palace. Um, Highness, welcome back. Inside the royal court, a number of nobles, uh, too, incompetent to achieve uh, positions of prestige, banded together. Jealous and um, coveting the positions of high-ranking officials of foreign roots, they devised an um, edict to expel all foreigners and immigrants uh, um, from kin. Both Ruai and Ruyufi were um, from, from other states. That's why they caused so much trouble. A nation uh, should be governed by its naturals, natural kings and nobles. That's right. Are you are the lot of you complete imbeciles? Is the powerful kin of today not a result of mediocrity regardless of one's origins? Eek. But with a single roar, roar from Rishi, both them and their edict va uh, vanished from the stage. Go, Rishi! I love you, Rishi! Like, I'm starting to like Rishi more and more. Like, Rishi is just a boss. Uh, thus the season turned to winter, and days of peace continued. Aww! Say's daughter is cute. Um, sorry, Kochan. You okay? I'm fine. Just got some in my eye. And then the curtains would finally rise on the turbulent 11th year of Say's reign. Concentrated inside the, this one small building, um, all of Kin's wildest ambitions come together. Ooh, it's called the beginning of the, uh, of, um, the turbulence. Here we go. Damn it, we're getting nowhere. It doesn't matter how many times we try, we keep getting destroyed by Kantan's defense units before we can um, get past uh, Gyo's walls. Why are you doing it the conventional way, you dumbasses? Are you alright, uh, Shubakun? Um, I I'm fine. We brought back uh, Moki, who has seen pr uh, prodigious, uh, prodigious growth in the last few years. And to prevent any information from leaking, uh, the four of us have been tackling the problem of how to take down Gyo, but we can't find even the slightest spark of a successful method. Back during the Coalition War, we were just barely able to come up with a workable plan. Uh, compared to back then, we've had plenty of time to dedicate to this task. But even with a um, year of brainstorming, our efforts have borne no fruit. Perhaps attacking Yo really is too reckless of a plan after all. Shoigun, I understand that the four of you are tackling a highly difficult problem, but so long as you ha do not have a working plan of attack to show me, I cannot and will not give the order for an invasion of Gao. I understand, sire. Moki, if you had to pick one, what would the, be the biggest issue we need to deal with? Supply and logistics. Um, to set up a supply chain that stretches as far from the front lines as Giao would take a substantial amount of time. 
Due to that, the Zhao army is sure to realize um, fairly early on that we're aiming for Giao and send their defense armies only shortly after. Then let's start with the assumption that there won't be a supply chain. But that's far too dangerous, sir. We need to examine just how dangerous this may be. Um, Sensei, we're searching for a path that no one can see. There's sure to be an entrance somewhere that will lead us to the answer we seek. Oh, here we go. We're with the Shin unit. I told you not to leave any gaps. What? <laughs> now you've gotten to split up. Shit. You're too far out, moron. God. <laughs> you need to move out, move as a move as a squad. Move to move too far out, and you'll get ganged up on. Still no news from Shoikan? That's the old tortoise formation, you idiots. Yeah. Um. Back during the end of the year, he sent us a message telling us to pick up the pace on the training of our new troops. So I figured he was going to send the High Shin unit to the front lines as soon as the new year ki um came. But there's been no word at all since then. No, no, not like that. Watch me and carefully, then pull back and let it woot uh. Let it go like whoosh. See? Nope, we didn't get it at all. Carrier 10, the archers aren't getting anywhere. You're goddamn awful at teaching, aren't you? If we don't move for, um, east from Kokyu soon, Zhao's defenses are only going to get even stronger. None of uh, um, our other big armies seem to be making any movements either. What exactly is Sensei up to? Oi, Tan, switch out um, with your bro and teach him. Sh sure. Um, or first you need to pull back, then let it go like whoosh. Oh, man, that was hilarious. 20 Li, which is basically 8 to 10 kilometers, or 5 to 6 freedom units, of um, Kokyokin, past the uh, Zaokin front, uh, front line border. <gasps> Wotin! Yee! I love Wotin. Um, this is pretty bad. Damn it, so it was true. There weren't any signs of a city there last year. It's not that big, but it, it's still go not going to fall to anything less than an army. I heard about Revoku's fortification plans, but I never imagined it would be to this degree. Even if it, it's premature, we really need to start moving out from Kokyu so we can interfere, interfere with Zhao's plans. Otherwise, the whole of Western Zhao is going to end up in a stalemate, Sensei. Uh, they noticed us, but there, there's not that many of them. We probably could take them on easy. That'll just lead to need, needless uh, casualties on our part. We came too far um, out on our own. Let's head back to Kokyu. Yes, sir. Wotensama, a messenger, a messenger this far out? Um, it's from uh, Kanyo, a top priority message from the chief, from Sensei? The Gakuka unit is to remain at position at Kokuyu, but Motensama is to hurry back to Kan um, Kanyo immediately. What? Uh, Waken front lines, hope lane. These way bastards aren't budging as usual. Maybe it's about time we went to them instead. It's been ages. Don't be rash, Kokin. Sir, top priority message. Um. Oh, Hansama, orders from the chief for you to get a uh, return to Kanyo as soon as possible. To Kanyo? Kin uh, um, Enmin, Haishin unit training grounds. Zo! Uh, oh shit, they've learned how to move together as one now. Dra, but damn, there's too much of a gap individually. They're rolling right over us. Oh, Rob, what's the matter, senpais? W why don't um, you stop us if you can't? What? Uh-oh. That smirk! That shit smirk! Captain, message from the chief. He wants you and Karyoten to head over to Kanyo tomorrow. Ah, yo. Oh, ha, uh, oh, ha, Moten, you guys got the call too? So it would seem. But what would, the most, uh, what would be um, important enough to summon the two of you all the way from the front lines? I see you all arrived. Uh, there are matters we need to discuss. Come. I have a bad feeling about this. <laughs> the look on Moten's face is priceless. Right, come on, you three, let's go. Don't act in charge when you're the lowest here. Who are you calling the lowest, huh? Oh my god, Moten! I love Moten's face. Oh my god. So this chapter was really good. We got some, um, we got an idea of what's happening, and our three favorites got Summon. So the plans are all starting to come together. Oh my god, this is going to be exciting. So we know, we got an idea who's going to Gao, obviously. Our three captains are going to Gao. The plan is in set. We're going to find out um, what the strategy is next chapter. And I got a feeling, I got a feeling, after um, our three captains have their orders in Gao, the orders for Kaki, it's going the mountains, will be fucking set too. I'm gonna know your thoughts about this shit. 
Anyway, remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigans Inc. And if you love what I'm doing and want to uh, support the Nerdigans Inc. expansion, there's a couple ways you can do that. You can donate to the Nerdigans Inc. Uh, Patreon or purchase something off the Nerdigans Inc. Amazon wishlist. Both links are in the description box below. And, if, and uh, make sure you follow me on the Twits, aka Twitter. Um, Follow my Twitch channel and purchase some and friend um sorry and uh friend me on PlayStation Network and until next time my fellow nerdigans I will be seeing you later bye.